Why not having an LLC agreement can be a huge mistake. Now, if you have experience with LLCs, you might have figured out that you can just file a certificate of formation with the state, articles of organization, whatever they might call it in the applicable jurisdiction. You'll get a business number. You'll have a filing number. You can use that to get an EIN from the IRS. You can get a bank account. A lot of times you can get pretty far down the road with just having filed a document with the state and not actually set up an LLC agreement. Why would you go the extra step to actually write an LLC agreement or to sit down with a lawyer to create an LLC agreement? Here's why. It's just some of the reasons we're going to cover today. But one of the reasons why you actually want an LLC agreement in addition to what you file with the state is you want to make clear who the owners are. We've seen cases where people have come back later claiming they're the owner of an LLC. No written LLC agreement, no real evidence to show who was or wasn't the owner of the company. That's why you want that. There's also additional liability protection provisions which you can build into that LLC agreement. In some jurisdictions, the LLC agreement is contemplated by the LLC statute, so you may actually need to have an LLC agreement in addition to that certificate of formation filed with the state to make sure that you are actually in control and you have a fully formed LLC. So even if you're the only owner, it makes sense in many cases to go the extra step of writing that LLC agreement. A lawyer in your jurisdiction can tell you whether that's really necessary and what the benefits and advantages are. Additionally, if you're in a multi-owner situation, that LLC agreement may provide you lots of protection in the event of a disagreement or a change in direction with the owners. So you really want to sit down with a good lawyer and get that really well-built agreement because it's going to provide you a lot of protection. So even if you formed your LLC, whether you've done it now or in the past, it's a great time to go sit down with a lawyer, look over what you've done, and look at fixing those holes to potentially protect yourself and make sure that you are legally sound. If you're thinking about your business, the future of business, make sure you subscribe to this channel. Go check out our library of past videos where you'll find tons of resources. Tell your friends and come hang out with us in the comments. The only thing I say about the comments is remember it is YouTube. Comments are not confidential, so other people may see them. But do feel free to drop your general questions. We often learn from the audience, and often our video topic ideas come from the questions asked. So we may cover questions you ask in a very general way, and that may help you in your journey, and it will help others as well. All right, folks, thanks for tuning in. Make sure you subscribe. Check out our past videos. This is Arshan. I'm signing off, but I look forward to seeing you for another video again very soon.